Now, in a statement, the employers' body, the Federation of Kenya Employers, FKE, noted that all employers should comply with the court order and hold the mandatory deductions pending the hearing and determination of the appeal. This statement read this on the court. In light of the court order, we advise our members not to deduct the levy unless the court of appeal rules otherwise after the hearing of the substantive appeal or in the alternative, should the government challenge the said ruling in Supreme Court, the said court reverses the ruling delivered today. The Federation shall continue to monitor any developments in this matter. Our commitment is to keep you informed promptly of any changes or updates, end of quote, before it was declared unconstitutional by the High Court and now upheld by the Court of Appeal, the controversial housing development levy contained in the Finance Act 2023 was fiercely opposed to the point that the government struggled severely to explain why it was deducting 1.5% from all salaried Kenyans in support of President Ruto's affordable housing program. Employees began being charged a 1.5% tax on their gross salary starting July 2023, with employers expected to match the 1.5% housing deduction with the proceeds going towards the National Housing Development Fund. In dismissing the application, the Court of Appeal noted that the levy was introduced without a legal framework. According to FKE, the Court of Appeal indicated that its decision was based on public interest, which in the case was in favor of halting the deduction pending the hearing and determination of the appeal. This is Cuba News.